Hey, my name is Aaron, and uh, you're watching the American Scout Channel. And today I wanted to show you how to use a signal mirror. Um, this one is made by SOL, Survive Outdoors Longer. Um, let's talk about signal mirrors real quick. Uh, a lot of signal mirrors uh, differ. Some of them have reflection on both sides. This one does not. Um, the purpose for having a, a reflection on both sides is you're supposed to be looking through the sight and be able to see the reflection on your face and rush below your eye and so you kind of know you're getting in the right area. I find that very difficult um, and challenging. I like to just use my two fingers and uh, put the aircraft in between the two fingers and then use the signal mirror to bounce off those two fingers. So for instance, if I was gonna show you this right here, and you can see the light bouncing off the fingers. So that's what I would do, and uh, pretty effective. So what we're gonna do today is we're gonna send the, air, the drone up, and we're going to have it come from the direction of the sun, and then we're gonna have it come from the direction towards the sun, and uh, try to signal both ways. Um, the direction towards the sun is gonna be the hardest way to signal an aircraft uh, just because of the angle you've got to get on that mirror and sometimes it's very difficult to to just get it just right uh, but we got a lot of cloud cover today so it might be a little spotty but hopefully from the drones view you should be able to see me signal the the drone um, the other direction we're going to go we're going to go perpendicular with the sun sun's traveling this way air class can be going this way so whether you're left or right direction between the sun it doesn't matter. It should be the same same uh, principle here. So I'm going to show you each direction and we'll go from there. All right, so the drone's coming from this direction. We're going to try to signal it. All right, so I'm going to use the signal mirror. Try to position it between my fingers. That's with the sun behind the airplane or the drone. So that one's pretty easy. Now we're gonna try doing it from the other direction with the sun off to the, to the right or the left of the aircraft. All right, so the drone's now gonna come in this direction. Okay, I see it. Get my mirror in place. So that would be with the sun off to the side of the vehicle, of the aircraft. Um, so it's, it's pretty easy. Now the hardest one's going to be with the sun 180 degrees in the other direction. So we're going to have the aircraft coming from this direction. Sun is over here, and then we'll try it that way. All right. So now that the drone is coming from this direction. All right. So this one's going to be a little trickier. I'm going to stand off to the side, see if I can get the glare on my fingers here. Okay, so see how the mirror is super tipped, and I'll even come closer. See the mirror is super tipped, back. Okay, all right, now I gotta find the drone.
This is your one of your best resources if you're if you're lost. I think. Um, obviously, you can signal through fire. You can signal through logs. You can put whatever. You can do all sorts of different things with signaling. But uh, I find this being one of the quickest and effective ways, especially if it's sunny, uh, ways getting the attention of an aircraft. Uh, somebody's trying to find you. You know, there's going to be a lot of people out hiking this year and in years to come and. Uh, you never know when you can get lost. Uh, wilderness is pretty vast and uh, uh, you can get turned around real quick. Um, so, uh, to have something that you can quickly pull out and do signaling with is a very useful tool. Um, I think it's your one of your quickest lifelines. It's there, Like I said, there's many lifelines. Um, you, like I said, you can do fire, you can do logs, but this is your quickest lifeline, I believe. Uh, so, Pick one up, uh, it'll help you if you ever get lost. Linked in the description below, there's gonna be two signal mirrors. Uh, one's gonna be this one, the Survive Outdoors Longer, and the other one's going to be the one with the reflection on both sides. And uh, so if you wanna get the technique down of, of having that reflection coming through and on your face so you can see it, it's up to you. Um, like I said, I find this one just as effective with just your two fingers, and uh, I don't even hardly use the peep sight. Um, you can, you can do whatever you want, but uh, I guess the for me, it's, this one's just as good. Um, this one's made of a durable plastic, and I don't worry about breaking it or anything. Um, anyway, so this channel is dedicated to scouting and uh, not boy scouting. It's a little bit different. It's a little more. I want to say it's a little more advanced. I want to have an adventurous uh, type channel where you can enjoy, as well as teaching good, wholesome spiritual principles, uh, principles of scouting and uh, uh, a lot of outdoor stuff. We're gonna talk about outdoor products. So I hope you subscribe and hit the bell notification. Please pick up one of these uh, survival mirrors in the description below. It really helps support me and this channel. And uh, I hope you subscribe. I think I said that already once. And I hope you have uh, safe, uh, enjoyable adventures out in the wilderness. And once again, my name is Aaron, and you're watching the American Scout channel. These flies are killing me. Thank you.